I can't believe we spent $120 for this. Sleeping on basically plywood with sleeping bags on top of it. In the same room as a hundred other people. No food, no hot water, or even drinking water for free. You have to pay to use the bathroom, and you're sleeping shoulder to shoulder with a bunch of strangers. But I guess that's just part of climbing Mount Fuji. Oh hi, I'm Mina san Good morning. We are in Tokyo, about to check out of our Airbnb. We got all our stuff packed. Um, my backpack is looking a little thick. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm trying to pack all the stuff I'm taking with me to Mount Fuji in this backpack. Because we have to check out of this Airbnb, then check into another one near Mount Fuji and then check back into this one when we're done. <laughs> All to save some money. <laughs> so we're about to head out, try to catch the train, make it all the way down to Mount Fuji so we can start our climb. So my breakfast is from Vegan Burger Nourish and it's the same sandwich that Sarah got yesterday but with a black bun, I have no idea why the bun is black, but it looks good. Ready to go. to Otsuki Station. Halfway to Mount Fuji. Halfway there. <laughs> we are currently waiting for another train to take us on the Fuji Kyuko Railway. Hopefully we get seats this time. We didn't last time. <laughs> the last train was a limited express from Shinjuku Station covered by JR, but we didn't reserve seats because... We didn't think about it. We didn't think and about Google it. Google doesn't tell you. Mm -hmm. so. so we ended up sitting in between cars for most of the trip. We got seats for the beginning of the yeah, trip, so that was nice. Fine. And there's little lights on the thing that tell you when the next person's gonna be there, but didn't tell us, so <laughs> frick. So we got up and walked out, and we are so close to being able to look at the country get up above those clouds over there. But for now, we're gonna try to figure out where we're supposed to be for our train, because this says out of service. Oh, good. <laughs> to our Airbnb early because Masaki is so very nice. He picked us up from the train station, took us down here so we could drop off our stuff and switch over our bags. We have our hiking backpacks on and we don't have to leave our luggage anywhere. We don't have to carry two and a half weeks worth of stuff up the mountain. So that's probably good. Now we're gonna head back to the station, catch a bus and be on our way to the fifth station of Mount Fuji. So to get here, we took the Chuo Sobu JR line from Shinjuku Station to Otsuki Station. And then at Otsuki, we switched over to the Fujiq Highland line. And that took us all the way to Kawaguchiko Station. I think that that's the cheapest way that you can get to Mount Fuji or Fujiq Highlands from the central Tokyo area. So that's what we did with, with the JR Pass, obviously. The JR Pass will cover the first half of your trip which is good. Uh, it unfortunately doesn't cover the Fuji Q rail, but that's okay. It's pretty cheap considering that you're going all the way from Tokyo to halfway up a mountain. So altogether, I think it costs about 1100 yen per person. So maybe like 10 bucks, not bad. 
And if you don't do it this way, you spend about 3,500, so about $35. So it's, it's quite a bit of money saving. So right next to where you line up, you can come over here to this booth where you can buy a round trip ticket. You have to make sure you bring cash, otherwise you won't be able to go. station of Mount Fuji. This is the beginning of the hike. I'm not sure if we go this way, <laughs> but it looks like we're supposed to go this way. I think this is the way. So we're gonna start our hike. It took us about 45 minutes to get here. Maybe an hour at most. Yeah. There is a bathroom that is free to use on this station. It's the last one most likely you're gonna see. After that you have to pay anywhere from 100 yen to probably 300 yen yeah. every time you use the bathroom <laughs> every water you get there's no running water on Mount Fuji so really make sure you bring change because if you don't then you won't be able to go to the bathroom maybe not even get water yep there's also no hand soap so <laughs> yeah sorry <laughs> but the fist station is very popular it has a very big gift shop uh, there's places to stay here lots of places to eat we're not doing any of that we're gonna start walking we're hiking. so we'll Catch in with you when we get a little bit further. So, so far we're just walking through clouds. Yeah, it's beautiful. <laughs> it's insane. You can't see too far ahead of you because there's just clouds. And they're like moving towards us and like away from us. It's so it so feels, neat. yeah, like if you can see that right now. You can kind of see it moving. It's like that everywhere. And it's really cool. The other spot was just a shrine. We got some good luck charms. So that way we don't die. Yeah. Not dying today. Not dying. So we just passed the sixth station. Did we really? Yep. I didn't even know. And nice. I got 5.2 kilometers to go. Sounds like nothing, right? It's all up. It's so steep. Wish us luck. We'll catch the view on the seventh. to the seventh station there's an excellent silent generator that makes it so loud we can't talk <laughs> we had um, some delicious chocolate we got some nice snacks mm. got some water ready to tackle this next climb i'm not ready to tackle it look and it, it looks insane look at this we're on to the hardest part this looks insane it feels like it should be almost over but we're not even there <laughs> we're not there let's get going Taking a little break. The air is thin. We are high. We are very oh, high. Camera's going everywhere. We are so high right now. We've been rock climbing for a couple hours. Seriously, like sheer walls at some points. Good thing there's chains on the side to help yeah. you. But I still like, can't believe there's old people doing this. And kids, like oh. old people and kids. Here comes the cloud. It's unbelievable. This, we knew it would be hard, but until like 20 minutes ago, we, th I think that, I don't want to be by him. Until 20 minutes ago, 
We definitely think that we estimated correctly how hard this would be for us, but in the last 20 minutes, I think we decided that it is harder than we thought it would be. <laughs> <laughs> definitely. It is a hard hike. This is not a hike. This is a rock scale. <laughs> this is hard. But so far, it's worth it. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's fun. As long as you take breaks, it's very doable. And we have plenty of time. Yeah. So we just accidentally made it to the 8th station. <laughs> really fast. <laughs> we were like, wow, this is actually getting pretty tough. And then we looked up and it was the 8th station. <laughs> and we're staying at the 8th station, but we have probably about an hour left of 8th station huts. Till we get to our hut reservation. So Where we're still we, going up. We might be sleeping in a room with 20 to 40 other people. <laughs> so we'll see. It'll be an interesting experience. I will. We're getting close. This is what our journey looks like now. <laughs> it's cold now too. It's getting chilly, so it's we got our hoodies cold. on. Got my gloves. I wish I had a hoodie. We're only 2.7 kilometers from the summit. So that's some positive news. Let's see. Mmm. Really? It's really good. <laughs> mm -hmm. Tastes like granola. I got the chocolate one so to me. So I'm gonna dig in. Oh yeah. Delicious. Mmm. For our hut on the eighth station of so Mount close. Fuji. Look at this. It's That's insane. where we were. <laughs> it's so crazy. And we only have a small walk left before we're at our station. Show them, show them up there. And this it is what that so walk cool. looks like. <laughs> <laughs> this whole mountain is just vertical. It looks amazing, and my feet are tired. Look and my legs clouds. are tired. And look at that little Tori gate up there. Cute. We're gonna live by that. It hasn't rained once. The weather is really great. Yeah. yeah. We have ponchos just in case though. We do have ponchos. So, because tomorrow morning is supposed to thunderstorm. Right when we're supposed to be out at the very top at the coldest part. <laughs> I really hope it's below us. Yeah, me too. But I asked the lady, she said, Gonzamora is next. And she said, Gampare. Means do your best. Welcome to our room. It is very large and spacious. So we made it to our hut, <laughs> the A station, and it is. It's something. We thought that it was 6,000 yen for two, but it must have just been translated wrong because it ends up being 6,000 each. So $120 for this, but it's all we got. It's all there is. <laughs> and it's very close to the top. Mm -hmm. So we can wake up tomorrow at 1.30 in the morning and hike, and it'll probably take us about an hour to get to the summit and see the full sunrise. For now, we're gonna hang out in the common space and eat some food. So last time we went to T's restaurant, Masako, the owner, gave us these cuff ramens as a gift for our hike on Mount Fuji, and we get to enjoy them now, so thank you so much. But this hut that we paid $120 for refuses to give us hot water or water of any kind, actually, even if we pay for it, so. I did a sneaky steal of some hot tea <laughs> and poured some hot tea into our noodles. And so, so we we're trying to uh, share tea. the hot tea between the cups. We got a hot tea tea We got noodles. some hot tea teas noodles. And hopefully they're good. <laughs> All right, so today it's gonna be a short more informational video on how to get to and climb up Mount Fuji. 
We made it to the A station today and we'll be waking up at 1.30 in the morning to get to the summit for sunrise. So make sure you don't miss our next video because you'll we'll see the sunrise on Mount Fuji with us. We wanted to make this video so that way you knew how we got from Tokyo to Mount Fuji and then up Mount Fuji. So that way you can watch this video instead of looking around on the internet trying to find the best way to get to Mount Fuji, climb Mount Fuji. This is a surefire way to get to Mount Fuji. Yeah, hopefully you enjoyed us struggling <laughs> and sleeping really close to other people. <laughs> if you think Sarah was wrong for taking that tea, leave a comment down below. <laughs> no one would ever think I was wrong. Give us, give us your opinion on them refusing uh, to give us hot water. <laughs> like, I don't know, I just, I don't understand uh, it, but. It's every man for his own at the top of the mountain. We got our tea. We got our ramen. So we're all good. Make sure to subscribe for our next video for sure because the sunrise on Mount Fuji is going to be something you need to see. <laughs> we'll see you in the morning. Bye. We've had an amazing and hard morning. It has been one of the most windy, cold mornings of our lives, but also the best sunrise that we could have imagined. It was insane. And we watched the sunrise together. On the most beautiful place ever, by the Tory Gate on the mountain. It was, I cried.